Hello everyone, and welcome back to Slime Rancher, and I, I think something, I think something important was going to happen today, but oh my goodness, we've been doing so much work on the ranch, and I just had such a good sleep, why is it that I feel like I slept in a little bit long, and the drones! Of course! Alright guys, let's stop playing. The drones have come out today and they are lurking somewhere on my ranch. I am guessing the slime science area. Let's get to this. Oh my gosh, that is a baby. That is a little... Oh, look at him! Look at him! Oh, he rolled over his little feet! Oh no! Okay, that baby painted hen hen was way too cute. That was just absolutely adorable. But the drones are here, you guys! Oh gosh, look, and we can see the auto feeders feeding all of my slimes who apparently need a little bit of a splash of water to calm down and stay in this reality, please. That is not exactly something I thought I would be yelling at my slimes first thing in the morning, but there you have it. But the drones, the drones, the drones! You guys, the drones! It has been the drone update, so... <gasps> there it is. There it is. I thought it would be so much harder to find. I thought we would have to like go gallivanting all over the ranch in order to find where the drones are. But here they are. And they were only 2,000. Only 2,000 new bucks in order to unlock the blueprint for the helper bot that can be programmed to buzz around your ranch and perform a variety of tasks. Well, can we learn more about it? Or, okay, no, it just says no utility. So let's do this. There it went. Oh my gosh, are they really that cheap? Are they really that cheap, hen hens? Okay, all right. Assistant laboratory hens, please assist me with the construction of these adorable drones. So let's see, where are they going to be hiding? Utilities, oh, they are hiding here. Oh my gosh, look, and they did need quantum plorts. Yes, and here I was so worried that I wasted all of that time getting the quantum plorts, but sure enough, we did need quantum plorts. We definitely needed the honey jelly stone even in hexacombs. So our guess was completely correct, you guys. Oh, I just could do a little dance right now. I can't believe getting the quantum plorts was the right gamble rather than the phosphor plorts. That is so fantastic. Let's see, okay, we can make one of them so far. All right, so let's go ahead. <gasps> okay, one drone down. One drone down. One drone. Okay, we have one drone. Where to put it? Where to put it? Okay. <gasps> what about right over here? No, it probably needs a little bit more space. Could, should I put it next to Calcifer? What about right here? Okay, maybe here? Maybe here? Okay, let's put it, let's put it right here. Our very first little drone. Install. <gasps> You're so cute! You are so cute, little guy. Oh, look, he's got all sorts of little scratches on him. And he has, ah, ah, hang on. He has the cutest little face. Oh my goodness. He has the cutest face. Look at him. I think he's sleeping and he gets a little flower. Oh, look at that. Hi, buddy. Are you taking a little nap? I've heard what you have to do is you have to water them on occasion and like splash them with water and it will keep them awake and active. But look at him. Look at him! It is the beginning of a brand new drone day, and he might be able to help us out with gathering up all of these quantum plorts, actually. So we can make more little drones. So let's see how this works. All right, the drone program. We need to select a target, and I think it will select the target inside of this area, so I don't need to worry about him flying off to other sections of our ranch. So if I select the target and I tell him the quantum plorts, if you could gather them from the corrals or outside, <gasps> they can collect outside plorts. Yes, Honeymoon's apiary. Oh, this is so exciting. All right, collect them from inside the corrals and place them, oh, either in the plort market or the silos. So I'm gonna need to place in silos. A drone can only operate in one ranch expansion. Got it. All right, so we'll go ahead and, I mean, I guess I can't have him put it into the refinery for me. So let's activate this. Hi, buddy. Are you gonna wake up? Oh, he's snoozing. He's such a little snoozy bee. He's so cute. I love him. I need to put a, a silo in here, I think, in order for him to do his job. So let's actually clear these slimes out. They have done such a great job contributing to our ranch for oh so long, but we're gonna go ahead and release them to the slime sea. I really hope that was the slime sea. Yep, there we go. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and release them to the slime sea and let them swim somewhere else. And yes, it is confirmed that is where they go when you toss them into the slime sea. 
Uh, all right, let's go ahead and come over here and then we'll put a corral over here And I guess we can come back and collect from the corral to put them in the refinery But I think until we get the corral. Oh, you're a little spiky boy, aren't you? Hi, bubby. There you go. Have fun. Keep moving. You're a phosphor slime. Oh good So he needs to be in the water all right, and let's go ahead and collect up all of these cuberries. And we should probably get... Oh, I have two hen hens that I'm just carrying around. There you go, little ones. Oh, and I have all these honey plorts. All right, let's ship these honey plorts. And then we need to take the drone immediately to the royal apiary. Because this would be way too cool to have the royal apiary full of little drones. All right, so tabby plorts. Let's go ahead and gather up all of these plorts. And clear the area. And then we'll build a little silo. And we'll see if he can get to work for us at collecting those quantum ports from corrals. All right, so there's that. Let's pick up all of these cuberries. Very nice, very nice. Okay, okay, okay. And let's destroy this. Whoops. So I'm going to need to come over here. There we go. Demolish. Ugh. And then I need to put in a silo. And additional storage, please. There we go. All right, so this is a silo inside of this ranch expansion, and we have quantum ports over here. And we have we have quantum ports over here. Do you wanna, good morning, hello. Okay, maybe if I have him gather something else. What about all of these mamingos? Or even the hen hens, can he gather up all these stray hen hens? Hen hens, this is just an experiment, okay? So he's gonna gather meat, AKA the hen hens, from outside, and if you could please place them into the silos. Activate. <gasps> He's awake! Okay, is he gonna collect up the hens? Oh my gosh. <gasps> oh my gosh. You guys, this is so cute! Look at him go! This is too cute, this is too cute. And he did a little happy flip. And he's just puttering around, gathering up briar hens. Look at him. Oh my gosh. This is too cute. This is too cute. Oh my gosh, he's just collecting all of the stray hen hens that we have scattered around. You're adorable and I love you. I need to make more of you now. All right, let me go ahead and grab these. And I actually don't need him to collect up all of the stray hens. So let's, uh, the drone is currently carrying cargo, modifying, okay. Result in dropped cargo, that's fine. We can let him drop all of the cargo. I am not worried. Uh, all right, so I want more quantum plorts, please. Uh, actually, let's have him clean up. Let's have him pick up the mint mangoes for us from the gardens and put them, and put them inside of the silo, please. Activate. Is he gonna drop all my, my chickens? Oh my gosh. <laughs> That was so cute! Calcifer, how are you doing? Here, let me go ahead and add to your ash. You're doing great over here, buddy. Oh no, 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 no. Okay. Oh, I'm gonna lose these. Okay, I need to I need to get rid of No 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 no. Will that will that go out? Okay, maybe it won't go out. Alright, so let's make another let's make another drone! We need to get this drone over into Honeyman's apiary because this is way too cute. This is way too cute. All right, let's go ahead and grab all those. There we go. I will need a new silo, I think, in Honeyman's Apiary, though, to collect up all of the uh, pieces because you can't send them straight to the refinery. And so I'm going to need to put them in a silo instead. So let's go ahead and make another drone with our second quantum plort. There we go. We're going to check in on this one. Look at him go. He's just busy, busy collecting up. Oh, look at the happy little face he's got. Just our busy little buzzy drone. Oh, and you can decorate them too. You can decorate them with the curios. Do I have a curio? That, uh, let's see. Ba, da, 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 da. Uh, let's do maybe the cute fashion pot. Because you can actually, I heard, decorate them with these fashion pod pieces. So let's see. I have a little hair bow. Oh, look at you. Good job, little buddy. He put down all 20. And now I can come over. Boom. <laughs> you are so cute! I love you! Oh my gosh, this is fantastic. And now she's come over to take a little nap. 
Oh my gosh, this is amazing. Uh, all right, well, um, let's see. We have a whole bunch of quantum floors over here again. Let's collect them up really fast. Is that gonna be enough for another drone? Because if we have two drones going, imagine the kind of excitement we could get up to. All right, I'm gonna toss all of these quantum floors in here. Is that enough for two drones? Yes! Oh my gosh, we can have two drones in Honeyman's area. We're on this. And meanwhile, I would really like this guy, and also you guys do not need to be fed that fast. I would really like this little one, if you could, little one, if you could please gather up all of the quantum plorts from inside the corrals and put them into the silo. There you go. All right, whenever you're ready. Uh, and I guess if they're picked up, then they won't actually do that, like if the auto auto gatherer has done it. So I need to remember that. But let's go put down Honeyman. Honeyman, I have free range plorts now. This is gonna be so cool. This is gonna be awesome. And I can have some drones picking up all of the plants that we have in here. Gardening is gonna be fantastic, but the true star of the show is going to be putting these adorable little things inside of the apiary. Uh, all right, so where should I put them first? Uh, little drone, little drone. Maybe up here? Because they'd be really cute up here. Are you done? Nope. All right. Maybe, so, because I do need a silo if we're going to do this. Uh, down here is a good spot. All right, so we'll go ahead and put one drone right down here. Hello, little one. Look, you're green and adorable, and the His Royal Majesty Honeymint seems to approve of you. And then I'm going to need to destroy, temporarily, one of the mint mingo places. But let's do this one, because I think this would be a good spot to put a... Uh, okay, we're going to demolish the plot. This would be a good spot to put a silo anyway. And we're going to go ahead and add additional storage, like so. And we will begin to store all of the plorts that rander, that rander, that wander at random here. So let's put down another adorable little drone back here. I kind of want to put the cute little drone somewhere else. Uh, like I want to put down, maybe, do I still have that big giant? I did not make that another one of those mossy tree stumps. They're so cute. Oh, look at everybody get a little bit of food. Uh, is there a good spot to put a drone over here? Kinda. I sort of feel like a drone would be pretty good right here because it would be able to see everything that's going on. So let's install it down here. And now let's go ahead. We're gonna tell the drone, all right, would you please collect all of the honey plorts from outside and scattered around and put them inside the silo. All right, is it gonna, is it gonna do it? <gasps> Look at this. Our free range plorts have come to fruition. This is amazing. This is absolutely fantastic. And now it, we're gonna have this little guy going around cleaning up our free range area for us. <gasps> this is glorious. Let's get the other little one started on the tabby plorts. Okay, so if you could please gather the tabby plorts from all around here and put them inside the silo, go. Oh, hey, Royal Majesty Honeyman, what do you think about this? Look at this, look at how cute they have little, oh, this is amazing. This is everything I always dreamed, 100% cuter than I ever thought it could be. I wonder if we should give them little crowns because they are actually groundskeepers here in the Royal Apiary. So shouldn't they have little crowns to go around? I think that'd be kind of cute. I think, I think cause they're like, sort of like the Royal Guard. Look, there goes another one. They're adorable. This is fantastic. I am so happy. I want more drones. We're gonna have drones for days. Oh my gosh, this is way too fun. This is way too fun. Look at all of these ports that we'll be able to finally gather up using the power of these teensy little drones. There he goes, gathering all of the honey ones, even the ones hidden by the grass that I didn't even see. And the other one should be gathering all of the tabby ports. Where did it go? Who knows, but it'll come over here eventually. Oh, they're so cute. There he is. Oh my gosh, look at them. They're so cute. Oh my goodness. I am so happy, you guys. This is going to be fantastic. We'll have honey plorts for days. Oh my gosh, it looks like the tabby. 
is like following it around. This is too cute. All right, we're gonna go get the little crowns because I think that they deserve to have little crowns to represent the fact that they are going to be helping in the royal apiary. And then I will have other, other helpers over here maybe who can help me with gathering all of the immense amounts of plants that I have scattered throughout this area. And who knows what kind of riches we will be setting out for from there because these drones are so adorable. They are more than I ever dreamed of. We may even be able to get some of them set up to help us out with selling our plorts so that I can just be making money passively. That would be so cool. We should try that out too. Okay, all right, let's see. We're gonna grab two crowns. Uh, one, two, that's all, that's all. Just two little tiaras. And we are going to bestow them upon the heads of the two drones that we have over here. So let's wiggle this way and find, there's one drone. I'm gathering up all the tabby spots. How do you look? <gasps> it's so cute! We have little royal drones! Yes! This is so fun! Oh my gosh! Where's the other little drone? Let's see. Is he gonna be over here? There are so many plorts. Is that just like... Oh, it's a, a tabby tail. Oh, there he is! Boop! Did I miss? I missed. I 100% missed. Alright, we've gotta go back. Gotta go back, who knows how long it's going to take those little guys to clean that whole area up too. They're probably gonna be busy for quite a while. Busy little drone bees. Ah, they're so adorable. I love how Slime Rancher has continued to evolve over the years. And we are still here in Honeyman's Apiary having a fantastic time. Mm, are you okay, buddy? I think you're stuck. There you go. Having a fantastic time. And now we are watching the little drones. Look at them go. Boink, there you go. Oh, that's so cute. They've got the crowns of the Royal Apiary drones. This is fantastic. And now we just have to be patient and wait for them to start dropping off the uh, the plorts. The plorts. Oh my gosh, are we coming? Are we coming over to the, are we coming to the silo? No, I think we're just cleaning up some of the immense amounts of plorts, plorts that are over here too. Look at them go. These poor little guys are gonna be so busy because this area is so full of plorts, so I might need to help them out, but... Oh, wait, 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 there they go! One of the... <laughs> one of the tabbies, one of the honey tabby slimes actually put a mint mango inside of here. That is adorable. All right, so they're still gathering. Hello, Bobby. Your tail is literally on my head. So when they hit 50 port plorts, they come over and we'll drop them off right over here. That is so cool. And then they'll get right back to cleaning. That's so cool. All right, guys. Well, we have set up our two, uh, our two little busy bee helpers. They're going to start helping us out, but clearly we still have a lot of work to do, and especially over here. So I should probably go ahead and help them out. Uh, let's put down the refinery link. I'm going to send out these honey plorts, the buzz wax, and the hexacombs. And we are going to try to gather up, dun dun dun, dun dun dun, cute little wildflower patch, there we go. We're going to try to gather up even more of the material needed, and thank goodness we had a great guest in order to uh, get even more drones all throughout my farm, and then maybe we'll finally be able to make some of my slimes happy. I might finally be able to feed them and take care of them and have them transport uh, food from one silo to the corrals and have them transport plorts from the corrals to some of the silos. Oh my gosh, and one of the tabby slimes, I think, put this pogo fruit in here. You guys are so cute. You wanted industry. We're evolving. Look, somebody else is bringing a carrot. They they wanted to be able to do this. That is just so adorable. All right. <sighs> With honey mint's help here in the Royal Apiary, we will probably gather plenty of those or the honey plorts in no time. And now um, we're just going to have to figure out where else we're going to put these adorable drones. But it looks like everybody is carrying food and everybody is helping. This is just too cute. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye.